very excited. Biking is kind of like um, driving a car. I like the bicycle program because it's taking people a lot. If you're uh, seeming to wobble, you got to keep on pedaling. Our program is absolutely outstanding. I'm excited for Monday when we get to actually ride the bike. It doesn't harm the environment with no gases, and it's very healthy for you. I'm just loving the bike and program. BikeEd is a six-unit bicycle driver education class. It's designed for third through fifth grade students. BikeEd teaches kids the rules of the road, how to keep their bicycle in safe operating condition, and how they adjust their helmets. Half of the BikeEd curriculum takes place on a fleet of bicycles so the children have a chance to drive their bicycles together as traffic on a simulated roadway. Bike Ed has two goals. I want to increase healthy, satisfying lifestyle choices through providing the tools for bicycle transportation, and I want to increase respect for cyclists on the roadway by teaching responsible, predictable vehicular cycling. The goal of Safe Routes to School is to get children walking and biking to school again. There is a non-infrastructure side and an infrastructure side. A non-infrastructure side is education type programs designed to teach kids about the safeties of walking and biking to school, much like the program here in Fayetteville. We applied for a grant that would serve nine elementary schools. We purchased a fleet of 40 bicycles that travel around in two cargo trailers. And these are all now the property of the school district. And then the maintenance is funded by a, a specialized bicycles grant. And then we also used grant funding to purchase new helmets for all of the students in this first pilot year. Part of the funding is then used for training of all the PE coaches. They were given um, league certified instructor training and some volunteers were also trained to assist with the classes. I think back when I was in school, if we had something like this, we would have loved every minute of it. Kids are learning, they're exercising, and they're learning how to be safe on the roads on their vehicles, which are their bikes, which is usually the first vehicle they have. We start the children out with some background so they can understand the responsibilities of being on their bicycle. And they learn basically that a bicyclist must obey all the same rules of the road as an automobile driver. Then we get to practice some of these skills in a walking drill. Before we get on the bicycles on a drills course, we have a day where we practice seat adjustment and then they learn proper tire inflation. They also are all individually fit with helmets and we make sure they understand that the helmet needs to be level on the head, that the straps come together in V's underneath their earlobes to keep the helmet from shifting side to side, and that the chin strap is snug.
Finally, when Unit 4 arrives, the much-awaited time, uh, the students get to choose a bicycle, adjust the saddle to fit them, make sure their helmet fits correctly, check the air, the brakes, the chain, make sure their bike's in good working order, and then proceed to the large drills course. We use a peer review form as they pick up their clipboard and their pencil and they write down a, a fellow student's name that they are about to grade. They then work to get that student a perfect score. I received such a tremendous response from this program. A lot of student and parent response, and I didn't even really anticipate that. Cooper had had a bike with training wheels since he was three or four years old and he was always very intimidated to ride the bike and with the bicycle skills training Cooper learned to ride the bike and he built his confidence and so one day after school he got in the car and he said mom I balanced today I moved the bike forward and I said you did and he said yes I'm ready for a bike so we bought the bicycle and he's been riding it ever since. He comes home from school when the weather permits and he's really excited to get outside and ride his bicycle. It has increased his self-confidence a hundredfold. He's a totally different child since he's learned to ride his bike. So many of our kids have not had instruction on traffic safety and, and maintenance of a bike. So it's just wonderful that they're getting the opportunity to receive the instruction and to have the helmet, and we have really loved it. When these students begin driving cars on the roadway, they're going to have the advantage of several years of vehicular driving experience under the belt to make them safer drivers. I was excited about the Bike Ed program. We ride bikes a lot, and so it wasn't a matter of him learning to ride a bike, but I really wanted him to learn to ride safely. And directly after the bike ed, he started using the signals. He rode a lot more predictably and less erratically. I feel like he, he's a lot better rider. He rides quite a bit around the neighborhood. The boys will come by and they'll all hop on their bikes and they'll go to the park and stuff. So I'm saying the same kind of things I did when I was a kid. Sometimes I ride it down to like Walmart or Target. Um, 
I ride it down to Dixon Street in the square sometimes for dinner. That's the fastest type of transportation that I have. I just noticed a letter from a student that let me know I was saving kids' lives every day. I mean, what's more rewarding than that? So I'm definitely interested in saving their lives, but I didn't know they knew that's what was happening. Ha <laughs> ha 